Hi everybody and welcome to part 2 of Let's Play The Sims 3 Supernatural. So I just woke up not too long ago so if I sound weird that is why and I apologize. So a lot of people said that we can go ahead and have Faye when she gets her gardening skill up and everything go ahead and um, have her go into gardening contests at the Auditorium. So we can do that and she wants to learn the charisma skill but she also wants to do play a trick on Elena so let's go ahead and play a fairy chick and see what happens let's see he's attracted to someone but I don't know which one it is either way here let's uh, let's test it let's come out here really fast I don't I don't know if it's her or not and then let's go and I don't think it's her I think it's her I think can we like call her over or something let me see um No, I guess we can't call her over. Okay, well, we'll have to see who it is. We'll probably invite them both over really fast and see. Because I don't know, because there's two girls and he's attracted to one of them. So, I have no idea. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and have Faye head over to the grocery store and buy some seeds and everything so we can start up her, her garden. Oh my god, I keep yawning. Wherever the grocery store is in this place there it is i'm like i must be blonde blind so let's go ahead and have her go over there and what is this uh fairy magic waning using fairy powers it's starting to take a toll okay um it's because she has her aurora on right now so let's go ahead and stop it after she's done so let's go ahead and get her some seeds and um all that fun stuff get some lettuce tomato lemon purple eggplant apple grapes white caps and that's all carrots i think you have to have like level two or level three or one of them i don't i don't quite remember let's go ahead and head on home again and i'm gonna go ahead and head over there I don't know if I have that hidden skill um, on anymore. Like the, um, um, it's a mod that tells me like what level they are. I'm going to have to look and if I don't, I'll have to put it back in. Because it does come in handy with the supernaturals and everything like that. So I'll have to look and see. Um, she wants to visit a whole bunch of places. So we'll have to do that. And I'm going to go ahead and let me see. Um, I guess we can put like a little greenhouse back here. Um, go ahead and sell these. Oh, there's already a... What is this? What the heck? Okay, let's go ahead and have them, her catch that. And that's that's weird. It's already a plant but we're gonna build a little greenhouse back here um so that we can make it so the zombies can't get in does she get one i don't think she got one i don't know okay come over here so you're out of the way and then i'm gonna go ahead and build a greenhouse Jessica you need to stop yawning holy cow um I don't know where it is there it is um I probably should put like walls and that kind of stuff first might come in handy okay I'm just a little greenhouse let me go ahead and see if 
the roof will fit on these. Um, wrong one. I think I need to go out one more. I think. Yeah, I have to go out one more. So let me do that really fast. There we go. And I'm going to go back one too. Like that. And then I'm going to go back in here. And there we go. And uh, there we go. <clears throat> and then I need a door as well. I'm going to go ahead and get this door. Because it looks perfect with the greenhouse. And it's pretty expensive. So we'll have to see if we can actually afford all of the greenhouse. How expensive is this? It's only 10 I'll be able to. Going to be poor. But that's okay. There we go. Put the walls down because that's just annoying. There we go. And then I'm gonna recolor this one because that's just that's just not working. <laughs> I have work in a couple of hours and I'm not looking forward to it. And I'm really hungry, but I don't know what to make. Okay. So let's go ahead and see if we can afford this. How much is it? 500. Um, it doesn't even fit. It doesn't even fit. That's just sad. So I'm going to go. Oh, crap. We have to get um, like those little potters or whatever because it's inside. So it's like going to be like, I can't do this. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, wait. Two, three, four, five. Okay, so we need five plant potters. Let's go into the supernatural little section. They shouldn't be that expensive. Only 55 simoleons. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. And there we go. And let's go ahead and have her plant. These can't go inside either. Um, let's not plant apples or anything like that. Like apple trees. Oops, I don't want her to eat it. Um, because they'll just get eaten by the zombies so it's not even worth it and then uh, purple eggplant there we go there we go now she'll be able to plant all of those and I'm gonna go ahead okay she's still playing with fairy dust and who's our natural cook I don't remember oh it's her okay so we're gonna go ahead and have her um, serve up some autumn salad after she's done doing that um, and then let's go ahead and have him just use the restroom and, and all that fun stuff. I just paused it for some reason. And Faye. 
you're getting hungry. Luckily, she's making some food. Okay, let's go ahead and have her ask everyone to leave. Um, because people need to go home. It is about that time that they should have been gone a while ago. Are you attracted to the guy? I think she is attracted to the guy too, which is insane. And I guess that's fine by me. Okay, let's go ahead and call household to the meal. Um, that's not. Okay, call household to the mill. There we go. Now they'll all come and eat. And then we're going to go ahead and have them go to bed afterwards. So, I got evil slumber. And then she can go to sleep as well. She does have her fairy house out there too, but we're going to go ahead and let her sleep inside because I don't want to have her have to always have to be outside to sleep. Ouch. All right. So what I will do is I will pick up in the morning when they wake up because having them sleep is just, just annoying. So I will pick up in the morning when they wake up. All right. So they are about to be up all up. So I'm going to have Faye later on. We're going to invite that dude, um, Chester Swain. And we're going to invite him over and get a little friendly with him and see what happens. And weird. Okay. I don't, I don't know. All right. And then we're going to go ahead and have Elena Clay go and she actually has work and six hours so never mind she's not gonna really do anything but get ready for her work day so let's go ahead and have does he have work i don't remember he does have work in four hours okay good to know good to know so we're gonna have him get ready as well so um he's gonna eat and shower and go to the bathroom and all that fun stuff and as for Faye, she really is not going to be doing much right yet. I might have her... Never mind, we, don't, we can't afford that. So I was going to say, we can go ahead and have her go and get some gardening books. But we don't have enough for that. So never mind. We can go to the library, though, and have her read some books. That'll work. Go take a shower, damn you. God, it takes him like an hour. And, um, let's see... We need to get the alchemist table next when we can afford it to because we need to start doing alchemy so that we can get the um, the zombification elixir so we can use it on a whole bunch of sims around the town for her lifetime wish. And then as for Faye, we just need to get her um, fairy skill up, but I don't remember how to get the fairy skill up in the first place. So... Let's go ahead and have a aurora of creativity around us. Yawn, yawn, yawn. And then let's go ahead and have her play a fairy trick, hothead, and bestow flight of velocity. What's that? I'll have to watch that because I've never heard of that. Let's see. Okay, so is he going to work? Yeah, he's going to work. Good. Um, what the hell? Okay, he was like all messed up. That was weird. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Okay, so be so flight of velocity. What does that do? What does that do? Um, we, the tickly sensation in the stomach is almost enough to lift Elena right off the ground. Okay, so, can she fly or something? Oh, she can! 
Oh, that is so cool. That is awesome. Okay. So she's going to go to work. And so let's go ahead and have Faye. Oh, let's get her needs up first before before we go anywhere. So let's go ahead and is she, yeah, she's getting some food from in there. Um, let's go ahead and pay the bills. And, um, she should be going to work here very shortly. Um, let's have her use the restroom and then take a shower. And then we're going to go ahead and have her head over to the library and have her read some gardening books. And what the heck is my cats doing? They're being rambunctious. Okay. So come on, Elena. They has learned to utilize her fairy form to get those hard to reach places and perform a fairy repair on broken objects. That is so cool. Okay. So I guess this is boosting up her um uh, her magic skill. So now Faye has unlocked the Aurora of Body and Mind to assist Sims in their training. That's good. And my cat is being loud. Are you going to work finally? Thank you. Sorry if you guys can hear that. He's getting in his box. Very loud, but yeah. Okay. So let's go ahead and head off to the bookstore or the library and her m fairy magic is gonna go go away very 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 fast so sucks okay so let's go ahead and head over to a bookshelf that will have um that those stuff in i don't know um there we go um gardening there we go and actually before we do that i want to greet some people so let's go ahead and friendly introduction with everyone um, because we do need a lot of um, uh, a lot of people we know to finish her lifetime wish and everything like that because we got to bestow inner beauty. Um, so, yeah. Okay, she goes through the wall. That's freaking awesome. And then, is this a ghost? <gasps> it's a ghost. Okay. So, she's going to um, introduce herself to everyone. So, I'm just going to fast forward it for a little while. And then, read some gardening books. And, there we go. She's meeting quite a few people. And then just the ghost's turn. Okay. Um, friendly introduction. And then read a gardening book. There you go. Okay. There we go. So, let's go ahead and get her um, stuff up. And actually, you know what? I'm going to have her quit her job after this. And I completely forgot about the um, the fortune teller career. So I don't know how I forgot about this, but we're gonna quit her job, and then we're gonna go over to the fortune teller booth and get her a job at the fortune teller because um, I completely forgot about it. And someone reminded me, like, hey, um, the fortune teller career came with supernatural and. I completely forgot. So let's go ahead and join the fortune teller career. So she's going to be a fortune teller instead of a criminal, which is fine by me. Um, so, yes. She has two, um, two wands. Um, that's weird. Let's sell one. She doesn't need two. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and end the video now. Um, Actually, let's go ahead and, and fight over this chicky poo um, and see if she wants to head over here. Um, he wants, They both want to like, or all three want to go to the operatorium. So we'll have to go to the operatorium soon. 
Um, but I'm going to go ahead and end this part. And in the next part, we will get um, Malcolm and Marigold in a relationship and all that fun stuff. And um, then probably get the alchemy table once she is out of work and everything. And so that we can work on her alchemy and all that fun stuff and then malcolm can hunt for her for all of the little necessities that they will or she will be needing for it but she only got a hundred simoleons today um so um i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope you guys have a awesome awesome day and i will talk to you guys all in my next video okay bye everyone <laughs>